Chief Meteorologist Jesse Walker. Welcome back, everybody. Wanted to show you national temperatures. It's 71 in St. Louis, but in Lincoln, Nebraska, it is 40 degrees colder. It's 31. All of this cold air is plunging south and to the southeast. There's a front right here, and there's going to be a little pressure right up along that front. Doesn't mean good news for us. I hope you enjoy today because there are some big changes that are on the way. First of all, I want to talk about what's going to happen after the precipitation ends. All of this purple shaded area in here. That's a freeze warning. This is for tomorrow night, not tonight, but tomorrow night for us, and it'll probably get extended into the next night. So nothing tonight. Don't worry about the plants tonight. It's going to be chilly, but not as cold as it will be tomorrow night and the next night. As a matter of fact, I'm going to go over that. Record cold possible. The record low for tomorrow night into Wednesday morning is 30. We're forecasting 30. The record low for Wednesday night into Thursday morning is 29. We're forecasting 31. So we're forecasting either right at or slightly behind the record. Again, this is for tomorrow night and the next night, not tonight. So you got a little time to get those plants covered up, but you want to do that tomorrow. 67 the high today. 40 has been the low. Those numbers are pretty close to the average for this time of the year. No precipitation today. We're at 0.79 so far. For the month of April. Sunrise, sunset for tomorrow. We're approaching 13 and a half hours of daylight. River stage in Terre Haute is going down just under seven feet. Right now at the airport in Terre Haute, we're at 67. Humidity low, though 31%. The winds are west southwest at 13. Pressure kind of low as a cold front and a low pressure are both approaching the area. You can see the change in the temperatures. It's 68 down here in Vincennes and in the Washington area, but it's only 48 in Danville. That's right. Within our viewing area, there's a 20 degree drop because the cold front is approaching now from the northwest. And it's not going to be this warm again for probably about a week, it looks like. Here's the front to the north. Moisture trailing along that front. So along that front, we're seeing rain showers changing to snow back off to the west where the temperatures are colder, as I was showing you out there across into Lincoln, Nebraska. Here at home, clouds are on the increase. We'll be looking at mostly cloudy skies as the night wears on. But on the doors of automotive Doppler radar, there's really nothing showing up in the immediate area. We'll have to wait a while to see that. So let's time this out. This is going to get interesting for you. Tonight, cloudy skies. Can't rule out a stray little shower tonight or early tomorrow. But the bulk of this is going to wait till the front approaches. And the front's going to be slow to move. So here's about noon tomorrow. Rain chances in the northwestern areas already changing to snow in Danville, Champaign, back to Springfield, Illinois. Again, that's noon, so they're talking some snow in the, in the daytime over there. For us, it'll transition in the evening. Here's around 5 o'clock, already starting to get rain-snow mix, changing to all snow in our western counties. Southeast counties may not see a whole lot until tomorrow evening, but then by, say, around 8 o'clock, everybody goes to a rain-snow mix. Eventually ending as all snow in the southeastern counties by, say, midnight to 2 a.m. So this will, it won't last long, but tomorrow evening into tomorrow night, we transition from rain to some snow. And then after that, as we get into the day Wednesday, more clouds will move in in the afternoon, and we can't rule out a few straight rain showers late in the day on Wednesday. First of all, let's talk about rainfall. Not a whole lot, probably a quarter of an inch or less in a lot of areas, maybe a little bit heavier in some places, but a quarter to maybe half of an inch of rainfall. And you wouldn't think you'd talk about this graphic this time of the year, but here it goes. Snowfall forecast for the area. Nothing big. We are showing a couple inches over near Bloomington. This will be more in the grassy areas. A lot of the area will be looking at maybe a little bit on the grass, car tops, uh, elevated surfaces, things like that, and it will melt away pretty quick. Then after that, as we head into Saturday's, the next chance of rain developing right there, that should exit the areas we get into Sunday, giving us better weather as we head into Sunday and Monday. But I tell you, big changes are on the way between now and this time tomorrow night. So forecast goes like this. 39 tonight, partly cloudy skies. For tomorrow, rain showers developing, changing to snow late, 47 the high. And then after that, cold weather midweek before warming back up some by the weekend and back to near 70 one week from today. That's your forecast. We'll head to Grant. Thank you, Jesse.